Kent Ridge Park. It's a hidden gem in Singapore. My friend Celestine took a trip down to the park and decided to drag me along with her. She had read about Kent Ridge Park online and was super excited to explore it. Unfortunately, unlike Celestine, I wasn't very in shape. After a short trek from the entrance, we could finally see the famed Dragonfly Pond. Did you know that Kenridge Park has the highest number and species of dragonflies recorded compared to other parks in Singapore? Nowadays, so many people fail to appreciate the smaller things in life. And I was one of them. But then, Celestine reminded me that sometimes it's good to spend time out in nature. I even got to see one up close. I got so intrigued by it, but Celestine wanted to go explore more. <sighs> How can someone be so impatient? Next, Celestine dragged me to the park's enormous fitness corner. Cambridge Park has the most number of exercise equipment sets compared to other parks, which are suitable for many different age groups. The Fitness Corner is a place where you can spend quality time with Mother Nature. Whether you want to release stress, or build up those muscles, while burning off that bag of potato chips. After all that exhausting exercise, we finally took a break at a spacious shelter just to walk away. While we were resting, something caught Celestine's eye. It was a memorial stone! Did you know that Carriage Park was actually the site of one of the last battles for Singapore during World War II? The Malay Regiment led by Lieutenant Adnan bin Saidi fought to the death with the Japanese Imperial Army. After reading about the tragic details of the battle, we finally decided to end the day on a high note. If you come to Cambridge Park, be sure to check out the Canopy Walk. It's a 280 meter pathway with amazing scenic views throughout. Cambridge Park changed my perception of parks as a whole. I am definitely looking forward to my next visit but I might have to build up my stamina first.